Hello, hello, Mancast91 here. This uh, video will be a cheat table showcase video for the 64-bit DirectX 11 version of The Incredible Adventures of Van Helsing for Windows 10. Now, the reason uh, for the 64-bit one is because it was highly requested because the only one that is made that I know of is the 32-bit one. And it's on Furious Revolution. But as I said, people wanted the 64 bit one and nobody made it before, so I, of course, you know, had to. Since I had the necessary skill set and blah, blah, blah. Now, uh, I made this over a year ago, but I didn't record a video at the time because I'm a lazy ass. But let's not get into that. So, here's the cheat table we have infinite items, no skill cooldown, machine parts, tower defense minigame, artillery strike. Call reinforcements, uh, Van Helsing codes, we have Lady Katarina codes, the shopping time one I had to make because I just couldn't wait for her to come back. Um, no, thank you. Okay, so uh, resistance missions, miscellaneous, we have gold, reputation, glory, chimera, and adventure mode. And then we have these, stupid cat and teleport. I'll talk about these last, especially the stupid cat ones. It's just ah, oh, so annoying. Okay, so anyway, no skill cooldown. <clears throat> so if we use the skill normally, I can't do that. Yeah, it's on cooldown. We can't do it anymore. So we turn this on. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we can. However, do note that this is an upkeep skill. So even though uh, if we give our character here infinite mana, we still won't be able to cast many. What's this? Six total. Okay, so six of them for 1600 mana. Okay, so let's change this to like, uh, what do we change to? Okay, this. 9,999. So, uh, as you can see here, the mana potion icon is blinking. This is, uh, you can call it a glitch, but it's not really. This is because we have way more mana than, you know, we, we normally have, so it's not full. That's what the game thinks. So if we want to get rid of that, we just basically change the value of the mana potion cooldown code to anything other than zero, and so the game now thinks it's on cooldown and it will stop blinking, yay. That's one problem done. So, now that we have a ton of mana, we can use this skill as many times as we want. Isn't that just nice? So, do you want to see something awesome? Of course you do. Why am I even asking? Show. Here we have Doomstorm. Let's see what happens when we use this skill with no skill cooldown and infinite mana. <laughs> Be amazed. Oh wow, the game is so laggy now. The FPS dropped. <laughs> Look at them all. Look at them all. Wow, that's awesome. Okay, so we'll wait for them all to expire, die, whatever, and then I'll show you something even more awesome. Okay, now here we have Ink Leap. So if you use it, you know, with uh, no skill cooldown, infinite mana, you get this. Which is quite literally nothing, you know, nothing special, blah, 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 you know, nothing special, yada, yada. So, there's a little trick. If we give ourselves infinite rage, where is it? There we go. So if you give ourselves infinite rage and try again, what do you guys think will happen? <laughs> oh, just watch, just watch. <laughs> A 
<laughs> oh, this is so awesome. Oh man, that was awesome. Okay, that's enough of that. Now let's, while I'm still in the secret lair, let me just show you the uh, stupid cat code. The reason why I made that, and uh, you may want to lower the volume of your headphones or speakers because there's gonna be a lot of venting and raging involved. <coughs> so, the cat is currently here, see? Where the red light is, okay? But, it will go to where the chimera is, which is here. So we'll go inside, enter this circle here, and the chimera will attack it. And this will constantly, const oh, here we go, here we go, speak of the devil, here we go. This will constantly happen, and this is so incredibly annoying, especially if I'm doing anything with the chimera. For example, uh, setting the stats, whatever, going on hunts, uh, checking the storage, blah, blah. Watch this. Just watch this. See, so a chimera will chase it away, okay? And it will keep going back to the red light. See, now this, to me, is quite frankly so fucking annoying. I cannot stand this. Fuck, I hate this. I'm a cat person and dog person. I love both, yes. But this particular cat I want to strangle. I do, I do not know what the devs were thinking. Did they think that this was fun? No, it's not fucking fun. It's annoying me. It's fucking annoying. I hate this. Ugh. So, of course, I had to make a code. Let me just do this. I had to make a code which stops the fucking cat. It just stops it. It will not move ever fucking again. And so, let me just put it to the red light section. There it is. See, it will always be there. It will never move from there. Peace and quiet. And uh, just, you know, for the sake of my sanity, I uh, created a visibility cool for the cat, which makes it invisible. Like so. Boom. Out of sight, out of mind. Now it will never fucking move. Never fucking move. And it's invisible. Isn't this fucking awesome? Why did the devs just... just? I fucking don't know. I don't know. Fuck, this is annoying. Now Fluffy, the Chimera, has peace of mind. And I have peace of mind as well. We're both happy. Yay. Clap, clap, clap. Fuck, that was annoying. I mean, I love cats. I, I, just, I love cats. I can't help myself. I love cats. I'm a cat person. Fine, but this particular cat... I, I, no, no, fucking no, no. Oh, fuck, I hate this. <clears throat> so anyway. Uh, do note, please, that uh, this code will reset every time you leave the secret lair. So you'll need to turn it on again. And again, and again, and again. There's nothing I can do about that. Blame the game. Okay, so let's get out of the secret lair now and talk about the teleport code, since that's the only one that's left. Uh, the infinite item code, it's basically just infinite items, but only if you have two in your inventory. It will not work if you have one, it'll simply lose it. As I explained here. Read this before doing anything. See, this is very, very good information for you. So let's get out of the secret layer now and go uh, here, for example. Okay, so let's test the teleport code and the artillery strike code. Okay, cooldown zero, freeze. Whatever you do, <clears throat> do not get hit by that. It's an insta-kill no matter how much HP you have. Do not get hit by this. Boom. Awesome stuff. So, 
Now let's talk about the teleport code. See, there's two parts of this. The first are the actual uh, coordinates for the character in the map, which is these three. Horizontal axis, diagonal and vertical. And then the second part is the uh, last position of the character on that map which is this, basically. Wherever you click last, that's the last position. So, if we modify, let's say, just the character's position without modifying the last known position, he, as you can see, he is going back to his last position. But, if we modify all of these at the same time, he stays there, because the game thinks that that is where he was last. So, I need to hotkey this, you know, and to create uh, key points. For example, in the uh, first map of the game, or is it the first one, I can't remember, the one with the mountains. The one with the mountain uh, keeper, whatever the fuck. You can basically hotkey uh, the teleport to place yourself um, after the barrier, you know, behind the barrier. Which is just fun, let's, let's just put it, which is fun, you know. So, uh, that's a pain in the ass to do, so I didn't do it. If you want to do it, go right ahead. I have nothing against that, just please give me credit for making these codes. So anyway... I believe that's all, let me just check, let me just... Uh, input some more coordinates, let's say 900. Okay. And, uh, I don't know, 200? Yeah. Okay, so... The teleport code works fine, but it needs to be hotkeyed. Yeah, <clears throat> it does. So anyway, I uh, hope you enjoy this. And I hope your ears are fine. Uh, now, where do I pose this cheat table? That's what interests me. Where do I pose this? And should I make it free or not? I have no idea. I have no fucking idea. I'll, I'll need to think about that. So anyway, I'm ending the video here. I hope you liked it. <sighs> I'm gonna... Do something else. I'm gonna get some rests. Bye.